just went through this toll station, right? I'm over here in Chesapeake Bay, Virginia, and I'm trying to get over this bridge, right? So they're saying the back of my trailer is too high. I don't already dumped the front. The front of my trailer was too high. I think it was like 13.8. The max amount for that tunnel is 13.6. So I'm trying to dump the back of my trailer airbags, but I have to um, loosen my, my leveling valve. Right there. Right. So I need to take off that boat so I can dump these airbags. So I don't know how I'm about to do this. I got my tools with me. Right. Let's see what I got. I got the tools. I got the tools. Right. Then I got some WD-40 to loosen up my boat a little bit. Right. Let's see what I got. I got the tools. I got the tools. I got the tools. I got the tools. And then just go from there. Y'all wish me luck. <laughs> it's crazy let's get into the tools i used a socket wrench an 11 millimeter head socket wrench adapter and a pair of pliers all right so yes i'm up under this trailer let's get into it so beginning this i put it on the wrong end as you can see i started on the end with the nut when I was actually supposed to start with the end using my adapter, as you can see, on the bolt side. So I finally figured it out. Once I got it locked on, I twerked it, pulled it, used as much strength as I could. I still needed some stability on the right side. So I placed my pliers there and I kept working it, twerking it, working it, working it, working it until I loosened up that nut loosened it up up oh, i'm a little bit too loose so i had to grab that that 11 millimeter back put the head back on twist it some more twist it twist it mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bam. yes yes the air is loose as you can see that's the bolt it broke i got my wd-40 that's what i used I'm holding up my washers because these I have to keep up with in order to replace the bolt that broke. As you continue to hear the air seep out, my airbags become lower and lower, which helps me to make it up under the bridge and the tunnel. Make sure I stay in the gym. Woo. I gotta find that bolt. Yeah, I got all the pieces. Woo. If you got some tools in your truck and you ain't using them because you don't know how to use them, trust me. When it's time to go pick up that load and we're going to get you home, you're going to know how to use that. <laughs> you're going to know how to use those tools. <laughs> you're going you to your way to understand how to use those tools whether it be from youtube trial and error it don't even matter by any means to get back down this road so we i done got dirty y'all done seen me crawl up under that trailer and uh do what i had to do to get down this road all right so this is something y'all should have on your truck at all times. Little zip ties. You never know when you might need them. So I got mine out because I need them to adjust my leveling valve until I can get a bolt. Alright, I gotta get a bolt. So I'm gonna have to hold my leveling valve in place while I get a bolt. So I got like different lengths. Just drop one, I get it up. Before I get loaded, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put this on there before I get loaded. One, two, three, like three. I think I like four of them, that should be fine. All right, just want to let y'all know. I always have some zip ties with you. All right, you never know when you might need them. This is what I did as a makeshift. I safely secured that leveling valve. 